welcome to the Discriminating Gamer, the board game review show that found Waldo. He's in Detroit. Speaking of cities, Flip City by Tasty Minstrel Games. Flip City by Tasty Minstrel Games is a micro deck building game meant for one to four players. And your goal in Flip City is to develop your city as much as you can while keeping all of your citizens in your city as happy as you can. To begin, everybody is dealt the same deck of cards. On your turn, you play the very top card. Now, each card has its own set of rules and abilities, and these abilities can give you points, cash, or unhappiness. Now, you can keep playing cards from your deck until you reach three unhappiness assists. And by that point, your turn is completely over. Now, you can also choose to stop at any time. If you do choose to stop before you've reached three unhappinesses, then you go into the build phase and you take all of the money that you earned from the play phase and you can either purchase a new card or develop a card that you already have by flipping it over. Flipping over your card will give it a whole new set of rules and abilities that are going to affect you for the entire rest of your game. The winner is determined by the first person to either reach eight points or by the first person to play a convenience store as well as 18 cards all in one hand. One thing that makes Flip City fun is a kind of press your luck aspect to it because you don't know what card you're about to lay down. You're not sure if it's going to have an unhappiness or if it's going to give you the ability to keep playing. So you're never quite sure if you want to press your luck and keep pursuing that or if you want to play it safe and be able to pursue the build phase. Now, while this is a pretty fun game, I have to admit that developing your cards wasn't as exciting as I hoped it would be. I actually didn't have a lot of motivation to develop my cards like I think the game intended me to. While I enjoyed Flip City, I couldn't help but kind of mentally compare it to some other games that were kind of similar, like either Machikoro or other Press Your Luck games like Ink and Gold. And in that regard, I kept finding Flip City just a little lacking. Flip City is a cute little game. The artwork is really cute, the mechanics are fun, and it's really light. So if you're interested in just kind of cute, light, fun time, this might be the game for you. For me, I have to admit that I was just a little bit disappointed. I wished for a little bit more from this game, and I couldn't help but mentally compare it to some other Press Your Luck type games that maybe gave me a little bit more of a thrill. So my recommendation to you would be try it before you buy it. Thank you for watching The Discriminating Gamer. We encourage you to leave a comment and follow us on social media. And we also advise you that while you can flip a city, we do not recommend you flip off a city. Please somebody help me on my feet again And I don't know where I'm going And I don't know where I've been Please somebody help me on the solid ground It's a long time and I'll be dying Once a year I wind up in the band Which is when I go to the inside job which I make a run and bypass the first piece of ice encounter. Okay. But we're playing a tropical game, so there's not going to be any ice anywhere. Oh, okay. it just, it's a climate thing, so that's not going to work out well for me.